Okay guys, uh, it's me again. Let us look at uh, how to calculate uh, the sum of uh, horizontal component and the vertical component. Uh, the first thing that we have to do is to uh, resolve uh, the forces into horizontal and vertical component. So in this case, uh, for 20 newton at the angle of 60, uh, to the horizontal, I will point in this direction and it's going to be 20 cos 60 degrees. And then uh, in uh, this direction, it's going to point it downwards and then we're going to have uh, 20 sine, uh, sine 60. Okay. Then uh, in uh, this case, uh, we're going to have uh, this. We're going to have 30, uh, 30 newtons sine uh, 45 upwards, with in the direction. Uh, okay, upwards. Uh, then we're going to have uh, 30 degrees and uh, 30 newton cos. 45 in this uh, direction which will point to the left hand side which is our west okay so in this case you can uh, resolve this force or uh, this angle to be in uh, this angle or you can solve it here but if you have to resolve uh, this force you're going to say 90 minus uh, 35 will be equals to 65 uh, degrees so that means we're going to have uh, 55 degrees here then if we resolve this 50 is going to be 50 cos uh, 55 in uh, this direction then uh, we're going to have uh, 50 uh, sine 55 uh, in this uh, direction so uh, now uh, to calculate the sum of the horizontal component and the sum of a vertical component we have to first resolve uh, those uh, force at an angle so we can only solve a force in a horizontal uh, component or in a vertical component so to calculate the sum of a horizontal component is going to be h c sum of the vertical component will be equal to so okay in this case uh, you have to decide that uh, if you are taking all the forces that are going to the right hand side as positive that means you have to take all the forces going to the left hand side as a uh, negative so uh, you can start by saying uh, right all the force uh, in the right hand side are positive and uh, all the forces on the left hand side are negative so then you can start uh, you can calculate the sum of the uh, the sum of the horizontal component so now you can say uh, take uh, this force is going to the left to the right hand side this force is going to the right hand side then you can say uh, this one is going to be uh, 50 50 cos uh, 45 plus uh, 20 cos 60 which is, uh, is uh, this uh, sorry uh, which is uh, this 50 cos 45 which is going in this direction and 20 cos uh, cos 60 in the right hand side and right hand direction so if all the forces that are going to the right hand side are positive we then we can take all the forces that are going to the left hand side as negative so you can say uh, uh, we are having in the left hand side we are having uh, 30 we are having 30 which is going to be minus 30 uh, cos minus 30 
cos 45 okay it's going to be minus 30 cos 45 and then uh, remember that we are having uh, this uh, force which is 60 and this 60 is already in the uh, horizontal direction and it doesn't have any angle so you take uh, this force as it is so it doesn't have a uh, cos or sine so it's already in a straight line so it's going to the left that means we're going to say minus uh, 60 okay so uh, these are the force that are going to the left hand side and then these are the force that are going to the right hand side so remember to we take uh, all the forces that are going to the right hand side as positive and all the forces that are going to the left hand side as negative so then you can patch your calculator okay uh, because I don't have a calculator we can say uh, the force uh, if you have the, your answer has a negative that means uh, your force will be uh, your sum the horizontal component will be going to the left hand side which is east in the direction of east uh, but if you have a, a answer your answer here okay say answer uh, the answer is in Newton then if uh, your answer is positive if your answer is positive that means your direction uh, the sum the horizontal component are going to the right hand uh, side which is your direction will be uh, east your right hand side so if your answer you find your answer here your answer answer is in Newton if you find your answer uh, negative so that means uh, your uh, your horizontal component is going to the left uh, left hand side which is uh, in the direction of west which is your left hand side remember this is because uh, we take all the horizon the horizontal component that are going to the left hand side as negative so if you find your answer here as negative that means all your forces your horizontal component is going to um, the left hand side which is west then if your answer is a uh, positive you will have your answer that means you your answer is go your, your horizontal component is going to the left hand or to the right hand side which is in the direction of east okay so let's look at uh, the upwards uh, force okay the vertical component the vertical component uh, let's say for the vertical component which is uh, v c is equals to uh, okay we're taking all the forces that are going upwards up upwards forces uh, as positive and uh, downwards forces downwards what forces are negative so uh, that means all the forces that are going upwards so we have uh, this force that is going upwards and uh, this force is going up so that means our force uh, we we're taking upwards forces as positive so here we're going to say uh, upwards force is 30 sine 45 uh, plus remember we are taking upwards forces as positive and this one is positive and this one uh, is positive which is plus 50 uh, sine 55 so um, it's because uh, these two uh, forces are going upwards then these two forces are positive so the downwards forces we only have uh, 30 sine 60 so the 20 sine 60 so that means our downwards forces are negative that means we have going to say minus minus uh, 20 
sin 60 okay then you will find your answer if you find your answer has positive that means your horizontal component are going upwards so if you find your vertical component your vertical component as a uh, positive that means your force are going upwards uh, and are going up and that means in the direction of north uh, then if your answer if your answer is negative that means your hor your vertical component is going downwards is going downwards uh, in the direction of uh, south yeah so if you have uh, these uh, two forces if your horizontal component is positive that means your direction is north and if your horizontal uh, your vertical component is negative that means uh, is uh, uh, going to the direction of south okay